Howdy, welcome back. So, today is some sort of day. I don't know, today is mostly cleaning, but I find that I use cleaning as an excuse to not vlog. I'm like, oh, I'm cleaning all day, so I don't really have to shoot nothing. But, yeah, today is mostly cleaning the entire, A, a my studio up here, B, the second floor, and C, the, the my room. The bottom floor, which is just my room and the laundry room. But I've been doing laundry today like a good person and hopefully eating healthy. Mary and I have a deal. If one of us eats healthy, the other one has to. I'm eating healthy till Disneyland, so she's doing it with me. But oh my god, I hate it. I hate it and I haven't even really started it yet. I wanted to bring something up at the height of the vlog, which is that if you have a skill set or a influence or a persuasion factor. If you can help somebody that is your friend out using that like e any of the like the skills or the, the thing is a lot of times normally people charge for things like um, if uh, if you're good at editing edit your friend's video for them if they can't edit like don't be a dick. Um, that's the kind of stuff that I'm talking about like people severely underestimate just what being a good person can do for your future. Like Gary Vaynerchuk has the whole like jab, 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 right hook thing. You don't really need to right hook if you jab enough. People love to get things and believe me, I like getting things too, but I will sit down and talk something out with you that is not related to me, That is that I get no benefit from providing shitty strategy analysis too, but I, it, it's not like I get benefit from conversations like that, but like I thoroughly enjoy helping people and people enjoy being helped. So if you can do a thing for a person that you like and you would help that person move a couch, moving a couch is just as much physical exertion as editing a four or five minute video is for me. So like mentally, like the, it's, a, it's about the same amount of that's a, that's a technical term, right? It's my new technical term. I'm just gonna measure everything in is. Um, I guess the theme of that whole scene is be a good fucking person. Don't be a dick. Not that anyone is being a dick to me currently. It was just a thing that I was thinking about. My coffee tastes freezer burnt. Just, I just realized this. I, I forgot to, this is why I don't eat healthy. This right here. See, because all my healthy food has to be put in the oven, and I forgot to heat the fucking oven up! Fuck, I wasn't out of frame. I'm fairly certain people who watch vloggers with DSLRs forget what it's like for vloggers to have DSLRs. Like, these are seriously big cameras. <laughs> And then like whenever, and then like whenever they see the video of a vlogger with a DSLR, they're always like, ooh, right, ugh. <laughs> like when I was at VidCon at a Casey Neistat panel, people actually saw him and were surprised that he had the camera on. And then when I was at that party, he also had the cam, like he still had the camera because it's what he fucking does. And every, people were like literally like, why does he have the camera? I'm like, look how big that thing is. It must be difficult. Casey literally put the camera in between his legs to shake my hand. Like... I don't know, it's, it's, it's a commi- It's a commitment, damn it. <laughs> don't forget this very important step, making sure that there's nothing inside the oven, because, oh god, that's hot. It's hotter than I thought it would be. Took me longer to set this shot up than I planned. Yesterday, a friend of mine, Rui, who I, you, you remember Rui from yesterday. Yesterday, it was so hot. So, he sent me a text way later in the day while I was editing, no video today? Fair, Rui. Fair. There was not a video up yet. I went to Rui's channel. Rui hasn't posted a vlog. Sent him a screenshot in case he was confused. Oh, oh, oh. I think tomorrow I'll have it up. All right, Rui, I'm holding you to it. Tomorrow, he says. Tomorrow. Tomorrow, new vlog, Rui's channel. <laughs> I love having filmmaker friends. Filmmaker friends are really cool friends to have. Well, just friend, friends who do things. Friends who do things in like the internet-y world. Everybody from like Austin LaRose to like people like Rui and Craig Adams. It's crazy how like vlogging has its own, has its own hierarchy. It's like, it's not YouTube where it's like Smosh and PewDiePie. With vlogging, it's like, all right, Casey's obviously the king. I just set this up to shoot this whole cool, introspective YouTuber, I love filmmakers monologue, but you guys just heard my fucking oven beep. That's take a priority.
Normally you're supposed to put an egg wash on the top, but I didn't because I didn't want to crack eggs and like whip them and whip them. Is that what it's, that's what it's called, right? Did my fucking freezer just open? My freezer fridge, one of these doors. When one shuts, the other one will open, look. You see that? Like that. See? Ugh. That fucking freezer will be the death of all of my ice cream. Did you ever just shut your camera screen and then forget to turn the camera off? 